This morning, their first concern was checking to see if there were any kids on the school bus. There was no students on the bus, and the, the students that live in the house don't go on this bus. So it was unrelated. The bus was actually in between two different districts, in between runs. So it had nothing to do with this house. It was just a coincidence that it struck this house. Yeah. And there is no indication that the driver was impaired. He simply dozed off. He did suffer a head injury when his head hit the windshield of the bus. But once again, there is video that the bus company has from inside the bus. So they saw exactly what was happening. Fortunately, no one was hurt. But as you can see from the damage in the house, no one can live in the structure at this point in time. The family will have to try to find somewhere else to stay tonight until it is deemed safe and inhabitable once again. That is the latest live from Howell Township, New Jersey. Anthony Johnson, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. Quite the morning in Howell. Anthony, thank you.